Hey guys, um, today I'll be showing you guys how to catch trout, and I have a derby uh, this Saturday, so I'm gonna be uh, spooning all my rods. Not all my rods, but three that I'll be using: trialing six pounds, XL smooth casting, so I'm gonna use for trout. So stay tuned. Hey guys, um, I'm just spooning right now a uh, four six ultralight Shivana rod that I've paired up with a uh, Evo Garcia rod. Um, I'm gonna be spooling up three rods. Two will be four sixes uh, ultralights, and uh, and the other one will be like a uh, five, uh, six foot, I think. Yeah, six foot uh, medium Shimano rod. Uh, that's gonna be my spoon rod. And then after trout season, you guys probably heard this before. I'll put some uh, braid on that braid. Yeah, let's go with braid. Anyways, I'm almost done spooling this, as you guys can see, almost done, so uh, I'll get back to you when I'm done, and uh, show you different ways to catch trout, alright, see you later guys. Hey guys, I'm back, um, I'll be showing you uh, two rigs, I'll let you for trout, and the first one is uh, just basically a um kind of like a split shot rig I guess we call it so it consists of a 4.6 ultralight pole this is a Shimano I'm not sure what it is because it's taken a few uh, years of abuse and um, the name's kind of scratched off with a Abu Garcia uh, micro uh, reel so this is a um, I'm using 6 pound test and oh, from the um egg sinker, which is like one fourth, in a real small uh, split shot. It's about two feet, and I've just tied on a a little uh, size ten circle hook. And for bait, you're gonna use um Berkeley par. Sorry about that, guys. Berkeley par bait. This is the two um. Best colors to, I like to use rainbow, glitter, extra set, and this is a beige garlic set. Um, I'll get, I'll get one that's open already. So, um, you can make them into pre balls or you don't really have to. Just scoop them up. Um, you get the power bait, you took, you squish the power bait on, and because you're using six pound test. The reason why this works is because the sinker's here on the bottom. Let's see this is, and the power bait floats up, and it's just uh, flowing the water, and the uh, child just come and get grab it. And you can either do a, a regular circle, or a lot of times it works better. Is you just just make funny shapes with it. And how do you detect the bite if if you run um? If your rod just doesn't go down right away, we have it on the bank with uh, one of these just stand on the ground, homemade, and it holds your rod. Um, you'll see um, you want this leader because the trout will be finicky. They'll drop it if they feel too much weight. And you'll see your line go out. Um, you'll um, push your rod, um, lift up your rod, pull it um, forward, and let, let them wait. And then when they grab all your lines, hit the hook. And that's the first rig, and I'll show you the second rig uh, after. Hey guys, I'm back, and I'll be showing you the second way to catch trout. Um, here in Connecticut, you have a um, two poles per person in the water at a time. So what I like to do is I like to set the power bait pole, which you just saw, these little nuggets. Set that, and just wait until you get a bite. And while you're waiting, like to fish a spoon. Um, the rule of thumb is uh, gold. You want something gold for sunny days and silver with um, cloudy days because like silver goes with good with the cloud. And a lot of people think it's the opposite way, but it's not because silver uh, shines better in silver light. That's just how it works. And this is probably my all-time favorite color. This is a gold spoon, right on top, which is. Uh, black, red, and uh, yellow dots. 
I want I have caught so many trout in this. Unbelievable. And I have a good six foot mono. And I have a six uh, foot uh, medium action Shimano. And I'm using this six foot rod medium action instead of those uh four sixes ultra lights because with this six uh rod and six pound test I can really launch these baits. Uh, the Derby Bell Fishing Act, uh Saturday is a small pond, and I can cast almost half, hey, yeah, half, half of the pond. So yeah, that's uh, two ways, uh, primary ways I like to catch trout. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, the show. Uh, my contest is gonna be tomorrow. If you guys haven't done so, this is gonna be uh, today and tomorrow morning is gonna be the last time you can uh, enter. You're gonna win uh, free baits. And I have uh, my derby uh, Saturday, and ho I'm not sure if I'm going to have uh, footage. Um, let me think. No, nah, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'll have a cameraman or not. Um, yeah, uh, that's basically it, all I have to say. And uh, a week from Saturday is opening day for trial, so I'll definitely have a video on that if it's not raining, because I can't shoot on rainy days, uh, or else I'll break my iPod, and that's not really cool. And after that... Um, my main lake that I fish at will be open, so I'll definitely have, uh, incredible bass footage on that. But the problem is they flooded it, probably like 100 feet flooded, because it's just a big bowl, it's a dam. Due to heavy rain and to test out uh, the new dam they built there. And I'd say it's probably still like, what, 10, 15, 20 feet, uh, flooded, so I'm not sure if they have that on time for opening day. So, uh, yeah. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's show. Uh, come, yeah, I got it. Comment, resubscribe, um, and definitely more videos on the way. Thanks for watching.